Hey, um, my name is Vicki, and I am the wife of an energy healer. His name is Terry Felker, and I have, uh, I've been a client of his for years, obviously, and um, I've watched him help so many people mentally, with mental pain and physical pain, and um, just evolve more, and uh, he's developed a system where he's kind of does like a weekend um, extreme cleanse, and each session you basically lie on a bed, and uh, on a massage table, should I say, and uh, he'll put crystals on you. Um, he used sound therapy bowls, instruments, rain stick, bell, drum, gong, um, all ancient healing um, and tools, instruments. And um, he's also a hands-on healer as well. So because Terry is super sensitive with his energy, he, he can feel the flow, blockages, he can feel that he can push it, um, pull it out. Um, he does come from absolute unconditional love. He has no ego or judgment whatsoever. So when you do have a session with him, you, you feel like whatever needs to come out will come out and you don't hold back surprisingly. Um, again, I've watched hundreds of people come in his home and leave different ways. So Terry has developed this thing where he does a weekend session. So it's five cleanses in two and a half days and it's pretty extreme and I've watched him do it loads of times. And everybody who leaves here, leaves here life changed. But um, he decided to incorporate, just for certain people, um, a massage cleanse. And so that's just constant hands-on. And he actually places the bowls physically on your body. The vibration you get is insane. So I had my first one um, last night. And I went in all super pumped and excited. And I'm, I believe this will take me to the next level or next realm or next train. Call it what you want. but. So I went into it super pumped, and then uh, within like five minutes, he was pushing on certain parts of my lower neck, almost like higher back area. But it was like he was pushing on it, and as he was pushing, it was like he was pushing buttons. And the more and more he was like pushing, the deeper my sadness felt. Um, like I cried deeper, I guess. I don't know how to fully describe it, but it, 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 yeah, I was just, I was just crying. Um, not that I'm like sad, it's just, um, I think, actually, not I think, I'm aware, I'm fully aware. When I flipped over, the tears actually stopped and I felt like, Cardinal, um, and the tears actually stopped and I, uh, oh, as they stopped, I, I did feel that it was all the pain that I've kind of been holding in this week. Um, I've been struggling, usually I'm super positive for almost everything. But this week has been really hard. Um, it's not that I'm rebelling or, or I'm out to get anybody or I just, nothing makes sense. And people around in this town and the world, everybody's just living in so much fear and I, I can't comprehend it. And it just, it baffles my mind, which then in conf I have conflict with my emotions. And anyway, so I just, I've been feeling really heavy all week and I've honestly felt like I, I wanted to cry sometimes just with being so confused. But um, during my session, it came out. So that felt really good. Other than that, I just felt really light for the rest of the day. Um, so yeah, that was really cool. Uh, and then this morning, I had my second one. And uh, the second session, I went in super pumped and no sadness, no nothing. And I actually kind of went in with the idea of like, I'm aware I have an issue. I still smoke. Um, I'm a yoga teacher. And um, I'm aware it's really bad for me. I'm aware I'm coughing like my mom used to cough. So I am fully aware I need to stop. And there's something, some reason why I'm holding on to it and I don't understand. So I went into the today's session like trying to figure this out. And today, like, there wasn't really like sadness, but at one point when I, he was doing my, my back and stuff, and I, I was feeling fine, um, feeling good energy flow and everything, and then um, I flipped over, and as I flipped over, I was bawling. And I wasn't bawling when I was on my belly, but when I flipped, it was like I changed energies or something. I don't know, it was weird. Anyways. Um, and I was, I looked at Terry and I was like, why am I doing this to myself? And I know I need to stop And Part of my brain telling me you need to go buy some. And like, when you're finished here. And the other part's like, I'm completely fine. 
And so I was kind of crying, and he worked well on my stomach, and it was weird because it was like he pulled something out of my stomach, which um, almost felt like a zap. So I actually flinched. I felt it fully, and uh, um, he jumped as I jumped. Um, but I was fine. It wasn't like it hurt per se, um, but it was like a zap um, somewhere in my lower stomach, which I'm actually. There's always, I've always kind of had things wrong with my stomach. Don't know what it was, but. Anyways, so that was really cool. Um, he also did this thing, though, as he came up the front of my chest where he came, like, near my throat. I think it was, like, just two fingers he was doing. And it was, like, I felt like there was a ball, like a bubble in my throat. And as it was coming up, I couldn't breathe. I was well aware I couldn't breathe, but, but I felt fully comfortable. And as it got, like, near the opening of my throat, I literally sat up and like went into the cover, the sheet, I actually felt like I puked and looked at him like, I puked, I, I don't understand where's a puke, like I thought I, I felt like I totally puked. Um, and he said that he felt like he was pulling something like out of my throat um, that was blocking me. But there's no like conclusions, there's no stories to him. So it might be kind of like a boring, I guess, tutorial review on my experience but it's real it's what i went through i have three more i'm fucking pumped pumped nervous scared all at the same time because you never know what you're gonna get um but i have one more tonight one more tomorrow and then tomorrow evening so i love it because this is what we do for other people and this weekend's all about me it's my turn um for whoever's listening thank you stay tuned if you want to know more about cleanse Three this evening I'll do another one tonight and I'll do um, individually the remaining two so stay tuned <laughs>